Hello my crafting friends, I'm coming today with a challenge video and this is for Carla who is Capamia here on YouTube and she wanted us to make a 5 by 8 card or bigger and then just anything on the card that um, she should know about us, like things we collect, our favorite color, craft style, favorite companies, do we have Copics, when our birthday is, and then an image. She wants it on the right hand side of the card and it's supposed to represent um, us. And then on the back, she wants us to make a collage of all things that are us. So this is the card that I did, and I'm going to send off to Carla. So I used um, some, it's a 5x8, and it's American Crafts cardstock. And then I used some of this pretty ribbon trim here from Craft Supplies 1. Put that on the top and bottom. And this is the die cut with a view paper stack that I cut out. I think it was a snapshot stack and it says top 10. So um, the first thing is um, I have no collections. I don't really collect anything. A um, long time ago I used to collect um, rabbits but I kind of got tired of my, I had a display case of them in my house and now I just have some special ones. My favorite colors are pink, brown, teals, like the teal aqua colors. Um, my craft style is clean and simple. Favorite companies, Echo Park, My Mind's Eye, and I do love my Copics and I'm trying to get my collection expanded. I have um, a lot of Bic markers and Pro markers also, but I'm really trying to get my collection of Copics um, expanded. They're really expensive and I don't like paying over like $324, $329. I can get the um, Chows on Uzak um, for, so that's usually where I get them. My birthday is June 15th, so it's coming up next month. Um, I just put on here, I'm not a fan of Halloween or like mini albums. Um, I have created one mini album for a challenge here on YouTube, but I just don't like using uh, mini albums. I like my pictures to be protected, and so I'm not really into making mini albums. Um, I love my dyes, all different kinds of dyes, you know, my favorite things, spell binders, and I love my girl stamps. And um, the things that I hoard are my laces and trims and my buttons. And then the last thing is I enjoy making cards, stick pins, favor fabric flowers, and altering items. Um, I have been scrapbooking the Project Lifestyle like way, and I like that better than the traditional um, scrapbooking. But scrapbooking is not um, my first and favorite thing anymore. And then on the back, I just did a little collage. Um, like she asked us to and I love hearts so I finally used I had found the Sizzix heart die um, with the little heart wings um, for a really good deal at the Goodwill quite a long time ago then I used my heart movers and shapers here some basic gray paper a little paper clip that has hearts on it and this little tiny mini sewing room die dress form because I love using my laces and trims and so I used a variety of them to cover up the dress form and then I put some twine wrapped around this little spool and some lace just representing um, you know I enjoy making fabric flowers and so and then buttons I love my buttons and these are some SP and Company buttons they came out with buttons now and then I love flowers and making flowers so I put that little cane company flower there so that's the back of my card for Carla and um, I will try and get this out in the mail to Carla this next week and I didn't write down when the challenge ends I'm sorry to say and then this little image I used here on the front I forgot to tell you about it it's a little um, digital image from sushi silly shy sushi dolls and this one is called me shy and I just thought it was um, appropriate and represented um, me I'm um, generally um, a very shy person I don't not a real people person so not very outgoing and you know I'm not um, real talkative to people that I you know don't really know very well so I thought that represented you know myself and my personality and I colored her up using my Copics and Pro markers, um, just in my favorite colors. I love the hot pink fuchsia colors, and then um, the dark brown hair. And so this is my 
par participation for Carla's challenge. So if you're interested, I'll have her YouTube name down below and you could check out the challenge and enter in. And thank you, Carla, for a fun challenge.